Am I disappointed about the turnout today? Who's mentally tough? Can you do what you're supposed to do when you're supposed to do it? That's really what we're gonna find out today. If you wanna be here, come get that work in. If not, hey, there's the door. So the goal today, obviously we're having tryouts, but uh, more specifically, we're focusing on where are these kids at physically and mentally. Uh, it's gonna be taxing today. Uh, it's designed to fatigue them, see where they at. You know, you always hear us talk about technique when you're tired. Really what we're more interested to see in today is not about X's and O's and scheming or anything of that nature. It's gonna go along the lines of seeing where they at mentally, can how they handle adversity. That's gonna be the baseline of how we judge all our guys, who's coming through the camp, and who's gonna go where? Who's mentally tough? Can you do what you're supposed to do when you're supposed to do it? And can you do it under pressure? That's really what we're gonna find out today. So. Give me two, give me two. One here, one there. Three, two. Well, throw that shit up. The whole workout is to make you feel bad. Come on, JP, this is what you missed last year, dog. Yeah. Hey, I'm gonna start the clock over if nobody goes in this station. Am I disappointed about the turnout today? Uh, I'm not, not, not as much disappointed. I'm disappointed in the returners who thought, you know, that they didn't have to show up because they, they've all, already been a returner, you know? How are you gonna be a returner if you wanna be the spot, you wanna be on that top team, but you don't wanna come in and, and get that work in. You don't wanna come in and try out for that spot. But guess what? You know, it, you know, reality will set in for those kids and the ones that were here that were here to work, you know, the, the, it's gonna show itself at the end of the day. We got dudes that's out here at JUCO that don't want you to get there because they want their job. You trying to come take their job, okay? You got dudes that's at home right now that sleep while you working. Understand that. Again, I'm gonna say it again. You got dudes at home right now that sleep while you working. D1 athletes, we don't sleep. We go to work. It gotta mean something to you. Getting to D1 is not easy. Trust me, it's not. And whoever told you it was, they're lying to you. Just cause you 6'2", you might get there, but I promise you, you'll be right back home faster than when you got there. They will send you home with no problem. Cause guess what? I can go find another 6'2 kid that can do just what you can do. Understand that when you get tired and your body says to get on your knees or to get on the flow or to sit down, you gotta tell your body, nah, bruh, I got somewhere to go. I got somewhere to be. My parents is paying too much money for this. So when you get tired, Make sure, keep that in the back of your mind. I got somewhere to go. I got somewhere to be. You feel me? The product we put onto the field on Fridays and Saturdays, people only see that. They don't see the work we put in, you know, countless hours in here, countless hours in a weight room, countless hours out in the park, countless hours in the sand pit, countless hours on the hill. You know, it's the work that we put in to get to where we are that, that has made us the, a true rare breed. And, you know, it, it's, it's, a, it's a privilege to, to own the, to be a part of the name, not only as a coach, but to see the players when they own that name and when they hold themselves to that, 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 that expectations, that standard, you know, the sky's the limit. The sky is truly the limit, you know. Uh, and and, and it, it's paid out for them when it comes to college, when it comes to all those other things. Like, colleges see that, that, that swagger that rare breed kids hold themselves to. And, uh, you know, I'm just proud to be a part of that, that the whole process. I'm proud to be in that, that, that little, just a little part of their life that uh, we get to take account for that I'm, I'm glad that we were here. You know, I wouldn't say I'm too disappointed because the ones that want it to be here, they are here and they, they wanted to come work. And that's what it's about. If you want to be here, come get that work in. If not, hey, there's the door. <laughs>